So we used the plate meter for measuring grass last week. We pumped the Chagas Grange today to look at the cut and weigh method for measuring grass. John Heston, he's the head researcher in the Derry Patch of the Chagas Grange, and John is going to talk us through the cut and weigh grass measuring process step by step. So the, uh, the aim of this is to get an accurate reading of how much grass you have on your farm in order to properly manage the, the days ahead and ensure and maximise uh, grass quality. Um, in order to uh, get the accurate reading of uh, the quadrant and shears system, um, you get a a representative area of the paddock and you throw your quadrant down in that area at a random location. So before we put the, the uh, sheared grass into uh, the plastic bag that we're using here to get our weight, we measure the bag on our little weighing scales and the bag is coming in at 50 grams so we'll take that away from our measurement later on. So I'm happy where that uh, quadrant is placed uh, to represent the paddock so I begin to shear off down to a height of three and a half to four centimeters, representative of where the cows or cattle are going to graze. So I'm sure to get all all bits of grass that were cut into the into the bag. All all cut. And if you have to cut again. Back in and, and cut the area again. Once you're happy with the area that you've sheared and you you're happy with the amount of grass you have in the bag, you you weigh it again to get the the weight of the grass. So this is coming at 130 grams. So before we can get uh, an accurate measure of the grass in a particular paddock, we have to assign a dry matter percentage to the, to the grass, um, depending on prevailing weather conditions. The weather conditions over the last few days has been mixed sunshine and rain showers and when we were out doing the, the grass to measure at that particular time there was a bit of a dew on the grass as well. So we're assigning a dry matter percentage of 16 to the grass at the moment. Using the, the weight of our grass, which was 80 grams, is 0 0.08 as a fraction of a, a kilogram, multiplied by 0 0.16 which is the dry matter percentage that we allocated to the grass, and multiplied by 40,000 because there's 40,000 quadrats in a hectare and that gives us a cover of 512 kilograms of dry matter per hectare on that paddock. 